Alright, luckily it's not crap. I'm ignoring him. Run! Up! Oh, run! We're literally here. I don't want any combat, I just want to get to this door. <laughs> Please let me open the door. Ruined passage. Excellent! Lightless will bl uh, sure. At least we can finally come in here. Collect Light of Meridia. How do I get in there? Do I just, uh... It's back entrance? How in the world do I get in there? Oh. <laughs> I just walk. Excellent. Bring the crystal with you. You will need it to free me <clears throat> from my bonds. Bail bonds? I have waited for centuries. And waited and waited. Do you know how boring that can be? <laughs> you are here. Just as Marie <coughs> Uh, Meridian knew I was coming? The Radiant One knows many things. She knew that one day the city she plunged into Cold Harbor would serve her purpose. At first, she thought I would fulfill that prophecy. But I failed. And now, I need your help. Where are you projecting this image from? Have no fear. I am as alive as you are. Molag Baal has preserved me so that I can endure his endless tortures. His cruelty knows no bounds. I can't slip free of this lightless oubliette, but I have managed to send my projection to meet you. So how do I set you free? I knew you were the one I was waiting for. Molag Baal locked me away for a reason. He fears me. Once you set me free, we can make him regret the day he made us his enemies. Bow of Anumbra? While you leave sneak or invisibility while in combat, your weapon and spell damage is increased by 331 for 15 seconds. Weapon and spell damage, weapon and spell damage, offensive penetration. This is... This is actually not a bad bow. Or a bad set. Just as I predicted. <clears throat> I'm glad to see that my calculations were not in error. Now, if you are ready, we have a prison to break out of. So how did you wind up in here? I was captured shortly after Meridia pushed her city into this dread realm. This prison relies on darkness. Early on, I almost broke free. Now, Molag Baal shapes the darkness itself to bind me. Suppressing my attempts to escape. So what should I do? Molag Baal has trapped me within a pillar of <clears throat> darkness, infused with his own vile energy, and powered by the light of Meridia. That, however, will be his undoing. The light of Meridia can also banish this darkness, but you have to bring it to me. <laughs> I'm on my way! To reach me, you must first unlock the prison door. Molag Baal uses crystallized darkness to hold me and suppress my power. Move the crystals from their locations to the prison door, and the way shall be opened for you. Wait, who are you exactly? I am the last alien king. In our ancient language, my name means ruler in dark times. I can imagine no darker time than the end of the alien people. I mean, I've been in there. It's pretty dark. Uh, have you survived? How have you survived this long? I am a servant of Meridia. <clears throat> her master tactician and strategist. Between my master's blessings and the time-distorting nature of this dread realm, I am still alive. Consider that your good fortune. For you will never defeat Molag Baal without my help. What? I could do it. I'll bring the light of Meridia to you then. To reach me, <laughs> you must first unlock the prison door. Molag Baal uses crystallized darkness you to hold said and that. suppress my power. Move the crystals from their locations to the prison door. Goodbye. He's just going around and saying the same stuff over again. 
All right, so now we should, in theory, be able to see, right? Because last time we were here was super dark, yeah. Perfect. So there's three. There's one. One, two, and the last one is there, maybe? Oh, wait, there's a door there, looks like. On the map right there, so we gotta go all the way around. And collect the life shadow crystal. Then place it on the central dais at the entrance. Okay, that was the three pillars. Tracking. Ah! <clears throat> I don't like where my bow is. My, uh, what is it, Endless Hell? Let me see. I want it somewhere easier. Vampire's Bane. I have Vampire's Bane on the front bar. So I'll put that there. Poison. Channel Focus, obviously. That's a good place for it. I think this is good. I think we're golden. No pun intended. Alright, let's try it. Much better. Hello, my friend. It's kind of funny though because this build is surprisingly really strong. I don't ever have to... Like, I just push four buttons and they're dead. Watch, check it out. One, two, three. That's it. That was the fourth button. I killed two enemies with four buttons. Three. Four. Of course, that's with the help of Bastion, but I'm pretty sure that'd be the same story had we not had Bastion. Ow. Switch weapons. Oh my god. I love that move. Stay away from there. Push this button. Now we can push this button. Oh, God. What? This thing is being aggressive. So is this thing. We're gonna need... Hold on. Uh, I thought I, I thought I already pushed this button. Maybe I got interrupted by getting attacked or something. Yeah, most likely that's what happened. Is that it then? Did I pick up the crystal? I honestly have so many questions right now. Ooh, books. Nothing. Yeah, place the... Yeah, we got one of the crystals, so perfect. Very nice. So the next one is right over here. Clearly. Ah! Bastion and his weapon power-ups, I swear. That's his ultimate. <laughs> then place it on the central dais at the entrance. Yes, ma'am. Even with the light of Meridia, it's still very dark in here, and it's kind of scary. And I'm, I'm, uh, I need my bib and a blankie. I'm scared, mommy. So scary. I'll help you, sir. So the way is left or right, it doesn't matter. <clears throat> I probably should have. I probably should start on the back bow, to be honest. I don't know which one I chose, though.
Ow. Blacksmithing? I don't need no blacksmithing, dude. Let's go. Stay away from my books. They're mine now. Restoring light to 48. Where's my skills at? I know I got 50 and something. So, Adric Spear, 50. 50, 48. So, restoring light. Do I have a restoring light? Ability? Channeled focus. So, I got two of restoring light in the front bar. Or in the back bar, actually. I just healed her a little bit. I'm gonna I'm gonna rock the back bar for a little bit. Okay, hold on. So, well, how do we go there? So we gotta go through the right side. So we're definitely gonna get uh, more enemies around here. They're not technically enemies, but I'm gonna attack them anyways. Yeah, he's gonna die anyways with the uh, damage over time. With my luck, or if I'm lucky, I would get restoring light to 49 by that. Hey, heavy armor increased to 47. Oh god, th <laughs> that scared the hell out of me. Not gonna lie. Are we getting attacked? Honestly, I don't know what just happened. Okay, so I'm assuming the last one is down the middle. Oh, there's a there's a door right here. Enter the frozen alcove and collect the flame shadow crystal. Then place it on the central dais at the entrance. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Hello. Can I turn it on, please? I need my light. Who's attacking? Bastion, are you starting fights? Kind of seems like he is. Whoa. Hello. Dunzo. They made their choices. Yes, they did, Bastion. You tell them. Can I avoid... <coughs> combat am I in combat uh bastion why are you starting stuff let's watch the battle from here okay screw it you take that one out I'll take this one out <laughs> let's go that should be it, right? Because Bastion should have taken out the other one. Oh, it's, it teleported me? No. But now it's all lava up. How do I get out of here? Yeah, just straight. Oh, God. Let me turn it on. Ba it's always Bastion. Ba Why are you always starting stuff with people, dude? Relax. Dope. Uh. <laughs> okay. What? Hello. Done so. Yay! Seven and seven hundred one. This is the last crystal too, so we should be able to save homeboy. 
Uh, oh. Well oh. Done, my friend. Now, enter the oubliette and set me free. I will enter the oubliette and set you free. The truth is the real answer here, because the truth shall set you free. Always remember that, man. That's why you couldn't, that's why you couldn't leave, because you didn't know the truth. There is still more to do to set me free. You don't say. My body is imprisoned within a oh, I see him. of darkness. Generated by the ebon shards to each side. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Meridia in both of the sconces. Each will create a beam of light that will strike a nearby crystal. Way ahead of you there, buddy. Oh, am I supposed to, yeah, rotate it? Crystals. You can change a beam's direction. How can you I may need to rotate a crystal multiple times to connect the beams and form a path of light to the ebon shards. I've already figured this out there, buddy. Thank you. Until the beams of light destroy the ebon shards, <coughs> then the pillar of darkness will collapse, and I shall be free. Come on. This is so slow, it's insane. Wow, this is slow. Uh, at least it's it's very obvious where you're supposed to move it damn can you whoops can you imagine getting tortured that much <laughs> is that it or no this has to be it if it's four directional this is this has got to be it bam Please let it be one. <coughs> Wasn't one. Please let it be this one. Oh. Uh. Wait, what? That was weird. Am I tripping? Did it seem like it was going diagonal? It was probably me just tripping. I don't know. Let me know down in the comments. Oh, I did it. Nice. So. Oh, there's an other side. Well, that sucks. Light of Meridia. Let the slow process begin. Uh, activate the south emitter. Is it just two? Yeah, it is just two. So at least once we're done with this one, we're good to go. That's the silver lining here. <clears throat> How long will that take? I guess we'll find out shortly. Oh. My god. Well, that's gotta be it. Uh... Okay, so it's this one. At least it's going by quick. <laughs> it's, uh... It's gotta go that way. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to do a full 360. <laughs> it should be this one, though. Bam! It's just really slow to react, unfortunately. Oh, you can kind of see the direction. Oh yeah, so... This is it right here. Whoops. Come on, Bastion, get out of the way. Always getting in my way, dude. This has to be it, because you can see the direction. 
Watch, you're gonna be able to see it. Yeah, you see, you can see it rotate. It's going clockwise. This one's backward, so it's probably gonna be a twofer. Let's see, now it's going that way. That means this, this is the one. Bam, right there. Man, I'm good. Hey, you're free, sir. <clears throat> oh, he looks awesome. My calculations suggested that you had a slightly better chance to fail rather than to succeed. I suspect, though, that you often beat the odds. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's get out of here. Wait, are you hurt? No. A little weary, perhaps, but not injured. My mind remains sharp, however. I suggest we make our escape from this place. It is the only tactically sound option at our disposal. I I don't really disagree, so let's get out of here. Agreed. Allow me to create a portal to Meridia's city. We can speak there. Awesome! That saves me a lot of time. Oh my god, bro. I thought of all people you would want to get out of here fast. Oh, that's where he's gonna open it? Waiting on you, old man. He looks cool though, I'm not gonna lie. The Alien King. This portal leads oh. to the hollow city. I push again when we are safely inside its walls. I pushed the button before he started talking, and it kinda ruined it, unfortunately. Uh talk to King Lorian Dinar. Discovered Fighters Guild Hall. Let's talk to the groundskeeper first. The pieces begin to fall into place. With the king's aid, we shall assemble a force worthy of Meridia's blessing. When did these people arrive? Small groups have trickled in since your departure. The warriors inside seem to be under the protection of the knight Darian. An exceptional fellow. Brave to a fault and devoted to lost causes. Cadwell found them in the wilds. Cadwell! I love hearing his voice. Or his name. Okay, King Lorian. I have barely set foot within these hallowed walls and I already feel a thousand times better. Yay! And now that you are here, we can determine our next move against the vile Molag Bar. Do you have a plan? I must take stock of our assets and resources. Determine just how much might we can bring to bear. Only then can I develop a strategy that shall allow us to win this war. Uh, but uh, forgive me. I wanted to convey that you performed admirably at the tower. This is a good tanking set. Well, decent tanking set. Uh, thank you. It is good to be back in this ancient city. I need to assess our strengths and weaknesses. Determine how best to make our assault against Molag Baal. If we strike before we build up a sufficient force, however, I fear we shall lose this war. We will not lose this war, dude. What are you thinking? What do you suggest? Soldiers, the ones who call themselves the Fighters Guild. They seem strong and capable, at least at first glance. I shall speak to their leader at once. Uh, I'm not really sure who's in charge of this force. No leader? Well, that's an unacceptable situation. I shall take command of this fighter guild force. It is the only logical solution. Talk to those within this building. After I consult with the groundskeeper, I shall join you inside. Not gonna lie, it would be of the high elf that says that they're, the only logical solution is for them to take the he the, the helm, you know? Oh, you- Hey, it's Cadwell! Hey, buddy, what's up? Smashing! So glad you could join us. Welcome to the Fighters Guild, which is rather a mundane name, isn't it? They're <laughs> nice. They fight things, and they're in a guild. Works rather well, actually, come to think of it. <laughs> I love him so much. He is probably the single best character in this entire game. You can disagree, you're wrong. <laughs> You found the fighter, uh, you found the Fighters Guild members? Actually, it was Honor who found them. Have you met? We've been together forever. He knows Cold Harbor almost as well as I do. 
Your... your pet found him? Ish, Tosh. Honor isn't a pet. He's my faithful steed. He does mistake the odd wood elf for a tasty treat, but they've been known to do that themselves, haven't they? <laughs> oh my god. Uh, goodbye. That's funny. Your nagging is becoming more annoying than my persistent rash. We finally have a secure base. To go back outside without a plan is even too foolhardy for me. You want us to hide behind these walls? To leave our comrades to die while you sit, whine, and lounge about? You have no honor, Knight. Don't lecture me about honor, uh -oh. Elf. <coughs> you have no idea what I've seen or what I've gone through. Is that it? Darian Gautier. My Probably mispronounced that. Display. The whole rash comment. Just a figure of speech, of course. So, I suppose you know more about this place than any of us. Like where I can get a decent drink? Is this the guy that everyone always makes a big deal about being like this handsome, half-naked dude all the time? I don't know. Let me know down in the comments section. This city is uh, a safe haven. A place where we can regroup and reorganize. And organize. A safe haven, eh? I didn't really expect to see cheerful flowers and clear water anywhere in this dark realm. I assumed we were walking into untimely and painful deaths. Glad to see I was wrong this one time. Good. How did you end up here? I couldn't let you go off and save the world all by yourself, could I? Not with just these fighters guild braggarts. Besides, there was a portal. How could I not step through and see what was on the other side? This is a, this is going to be a situation where curiosity killed the cat, isn't it? Who's leading this group? That's a good question. <clears throat> I heard that Captain Alfari was killed shortly after we were scattered. I was hoping to find another officer, here, but no such luck. I mean, I rescued uh, an alien king. He wants to help assemble our forces. An alien? I thought they were all, you know, dead. Not this one. Of course, this is a Daedric Prince's plane. I really need to stop being surprised by such revelations. I have a feeling that won't be the strangest thing I find out before this is all over. Perhaps not. Goodbye. Attend me, soldiers. Oh. We have a war to win and time grows short. Attend me. What in Ariel's name is this? Who are you? So that's the last alien, huh? I thought he'd be more dusty. <laughs> Isn't that what happens when elves get really, really old? <laughs> Shut it, you fuck. Who's in charge of this group? Step forward and address me. <laughs> then allow me to rectify that. I shall lead you. We shall recover your comrades and complete your mission. If that does not work for you, your services are no longer needed. I do I like him, though. You are, but you aren't fighters, Guild. You have no authority over us. Do you challenge me, then? Do you want me to kill you to prove my combat prowess to your companions? I wouldn't necessarily mind seeing that. <laughs> that, <was kind> of <laughs> <annoying. laughs> that was awesome. How can you expect us to lay down our lives with someone we never met? <coughs> designed on the battlefield. If you want to survive, if you want to win this, you must trust me. Allow me to explain why you need my leadership. We shall work this out. I understand your reservations, but with my leadership, the Fighters Guild will help us win this war. Is that it? Um. Do I, is it? Do I have to go upstairs? Found a found a lore book. I don't see where I'm supposed to go though. Do I have to? Do I have to go outside? Oh, I gotta... I gotta go outside. So let's talk to her and see what she says. Yeah, okay, so back to, the, back to square one. I'm assuming we have to go... East now. Black Forge. Great Shackle. Both of these kind of look like... Or sound like they would be... Where the mage is. But... 
We need to grab one of those meridian crystals and stuff for the light apparently so let's go do that first and i'm gonna google exactly where i have to go and then we're gonna continue right here right where we left off so let's go